As part of efforts to upscale security in the state, Oshu State Governor Boyega Oyetola says his administration has initiated and sustained inclusive security arrangement that brings all communities into a network to cooperate and support the police and other security agencies. He said this was aimed at achieving the security and safety that Oshun people desire and deserve. Governor Yutala, while addressing the newly trained special constabulary for the state, lauded the police and other security agencies for carrying out their responsibilities with utmost professionalism. I congratulate you all on the successful completion of your program and for representing Oshun well at the training school. I would also like to appreciate you not only for electing to contribute your quota to the revamping of the challenge, challenging security situation in the nation, but also for possessing the strength of character and qualification for enlistment into the Nigeria police. Oshun is noted as an Omodwabi state where hard work, character, commitment to duty, and honesty is second nature to its citizens. Despite the raging security challenges ravaging the nation, we still maintain this enviable status. To complement this profile, our administration has consistently given the security and safety of our people their deserved prime of place, supporting the Nigerian police and other security agencies to enable them to perform their duties effectively. Commissioner of Police Olawale Olokade said the special officers comprising of 44 females and 436 males have been equipped with series of trainings to support the efforts of the regular police, especially at the grassroots levels. Men and women you are seeing, uh, special constabularies, they are supposed to be committee policing officers uh, meant to be posted to all the local government areas. They are expected to work directly with the police so that we can, they can join in with us to work uh, with the people. Um, their major function right now is to provide information to the people. Because they are very close to the people, that's where we are sending them back to the local government, where they hail from. And um, whatever information that will be very, very necessary to ensuring the peace of that local government or that locality, we are expected, we are, they are expected to provide uh, to us. They are also to work directly with the police, so that, so that um, minor issues, minor cases, that will take the time of police, they will be in the position to, to resolve it within their locality in conjunction with the community policing uh, committee member of that locality. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.